Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whenever you are viewing this video, don't forget that this is timeless and take whatever resonates if it applies to you. First off, I just want to say thank you for everyone who has subscribed to this channel. I know that, you know, Right now, there's some crazy times happening. Just got like this download, like everything's just like in our face all the time. Okay, don't forget to just take a step back. Um, there was like this red little, just a tiny little spider on the screen, but it was like, whoa, like I had to like really like, you know, really focus my vision in to like look at it, right? So it was like in my face and I was like, whoa. So I feel like for the collective uh, energy it's like everything is just like in our face we need to take a step back and and really look at the situation um from a different perspective right so this is just like the download that i just got now um and i was like okay i need to start <laughs> putting out these messages so that is what i am getting as far as this pre-meditation goes i'm just gonna take a moment A lot of us are having trouble like just relaxing and like clearing the mind. I know specifically me, I do, I need to like really settle and relax, so. I feel like there could be a lot on the mind for the collective as well because everything is just so in our face at this time. I'm hearing the words look at me so like a lot of you are seeking attention or needing attention or needing more more attention okay um, I'm getting this aspect of like everybody's just like looking at you okay or you feel like you're being looked at all the time or being watched over okay you could even be your third eye um, you know seeing from a different perspective as well but know that you are fully protected even when you feel like you're being watched okay you could even be like having people around you that like is demanding your attention okay and that's why it's needed to like take a step back i'm getting the word focus so yeah, a lot of attention, a lot of focus, a lot of needing to like clear the mind from like any mental like chaos or distraction, okay? That's why there's that focus energy. All right. All right, this is a message for the collective. Take it how it resonates. We are going to go ahead and get started now that we have grounded the energy cleared and protected. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. At the bottom of the deck we have that I noticed, I believe in the power of I can. In regards to believing, I feel like the word believe, you have to wholeheartedly believe within your heart. The power, I feel like that you have, okay? Believe that you can do anything that you set your mind to okay believing is is the manifestation is the emotional aspect or the first state to being able to manifest the the things that you want in your life okay we have the ribbons and and bows okay so like you are a gift know that your body is a temple okay you are the power within. You're going through this heavy transformation. And once again, I saw I, okay? 
tapping into the third eye. We have snakes here, so very powerful uh, being. You could have uh, a spirit animal with, with snakes, okay? Um, snakes could represent, you know, um, uh, transformation, sh sh shedding off old skin, blooming into this beautiful flower, okay? A lot of you are shedding off this negative energy, okay? transforming into the person that you are wanting to be because you're believing in yourself okay you're believing that you can transform i'm hearing light workers so a lot of you are light workers a lot of you have came here with a lover or are going to meet your other half sometime soon okay this could be different for everybody, but you are slaying it. Damn, son. Slaying it. Okay, you are moving forward. You are piercing through. Wow. Who am I talking to? Thumbs up. Comment below. This is, like, just intense already. No wonder that spider was just, like, bam, like, all up in my face, like, whoa like whoa okay because you're slaying it out here like they can't help but to look they can't help because you are just transforming right before their eyes that's why i was getting eyes okay you got a lot of eyes on you okay this is almost like dna like, um, you're one with your higher self or your spirit guide or whoever it is that you're, um, reaching out to. But I'm, I'm hearing either other half, higher self or, you know, your ancestor, your spirit guide that you're intertwining with. Speaking of spirit guides, they were hiding. Okay, so I feel... I feel like because this deck in itself was hiding, like it was just like way in the back, okay, that is a significance to me that, okay, even though they may not be all up in your face, like all of the time, they are always in the background protecting you, keeping an eye on you. Okay, even though you don't always feel like they're there. They know that you're slaying it. Just know that you're fully protected. Um, and because, like, even... It, sometimes our spirit guides step away so that you are able to transform within yourself. Okay, it's all lessons. Alright, what do my spirit guides want to say from the highest light to all? Please come through, ancestors, spirit guides, loved ones. Thank you. Thank you. We have, yes. That's what I'm talking about. Your spirit guides are here. Vincenuan Galactic Council. So you have a whole council on your side, like 10,000 is what I'm hearing. Like, they don't know. They just don't know. Okay, the people that have stalked or preyed on you or done some effed up stuff okay they didn't realize that you had a whole council on your team okay i'm hearing that lone wolf okay you may feel like you're alone but you're not alone it says spirit guides answer the call time to shine you are definitely activating this light within you Okay, because you are believing in the power of yourself, you're answering this call, this galactic call, okay, with the spirit team, okay, number three could be significant to you, star being guides, so yeah, at the beginning of this, I was picking up star seeds, okay, so thank you, um, Star seeds uh, for for being here and viewing this message. If you are a star seed or if you feel called that you are a star seed, comment below. Um, yeah, now is the time to answer the call. Believe in yourself, okay? Because you are truly transforming into this light, 
okay? Through your third eye, through your heart chakra. Okay, I feel like your third eye and your heart chakra are aligning together. And because of that, you are like, it's like, boom. Okay, also... Um, okay, I got light, light worker. There's all these downloads coming at you guys. Please bear with me. Um, also, with the whole like boom in your face, like I feel like that's what's happening. Like people are seeing you blow up like right before their eyes, and it's like whoa, you know. Very unfortunate. I did have to, uh, you know, I don't, I don't like spiders, so I. I I freak out and I feel like that that is like a fear we freak out and we're like boom we just kill off our own our own um belief right our own destiny so like I feel like um another thing is like don't do that start believing in yourself that you can really transform and slay it whatever it is whatever mission that you have all right yeah, look, third eye activation. So, yeah, you're really going in and seeing things from a different perspective. Wow. Okay, clear seeing. That's how you're that's how you're able to transform currently because you have been putting in the work to really go within your heart to see things from a different perspective. What else, spirit guides, please? What else, counsel for these star seeds? We have inner earth. Oh, we have two. Inner earth and thoth. Okay, so yeah, you are going within. Going in, in the temples, okay? And reaching out to... It's the first for a lot of you, thoth. Thoth. However you want to pronounce it. Doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, you're really grounding yourself and tapping into this magic this divine energy okay because this says light initiation great teacher awakening and divine magic okay so a lot of you need to research about those okay some of you could be even giving offerings to those like uh like coffee okay some of you could even be writing singing building okay a lot of my past videos have spoken of thoth maybe we'll even do like a thoth uh, video because he has been coming out a lot lately just saying that you are really activating your divine inner being okay you're you're okay that's why i was getting number three Three, three, you could be seeing number three, three as a master teacher, letting you know that Thoth is there guiding you. Okay, that's what I was feeling like you do have eyes on you, and it is Thoth himself. Okay, we have inner earth, it says base chakra, strength and security, laying foundations. Okay, a lot of you had been doing the inner work, really grounding yourself, going in these ancient temples. Okay. You know, trying to understand why, when, how, okay, this is what I'm getting. And it really is activating this heart chakra of, of yours, okay? So with combining, like I said, the, the third eye and the heart chakra, which heart really like, okay, you have to be able to ground yourself in the root chakra in order to get to the heart. And then you can you know, be able to see. So it is a whole activation I feel like you are doing, um, just really um, going through your chakras to level up your light, okay? A lot of you need to be clearing out your chakras so that you can see and be able to um, transform. A lot of you have already been doing this. Like I said, um, it is different for everybody as this is a collective and timeless reading. So whenever it is that you are viewing this message, it is different for everybody. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below if this message already hits the heart. All right. But I definitely feel like you are gaining the strength by doing this. You are gaining the security, the stability, okay? A lot of you have been um, searching for finances, okay? A lot of you could be moving into a new home, but really grounding yourself and and getting down to the root chakra of the situation, the problem, or 
just really grounding yourself so that you are able to elevate to a new level. Like I said, transforming. You could even be doing this with another person as far as relationship. But I feel like both could be your, your divine partner <laughs> is what I'm hearing. Okay, your divine masculine or feminine energy. The co-counterpart. Okay, so really tap into both if you haven't already. Um, because he is helping you light that initiation to be that grandmaster teacher, okay? If you feel that you are called on a whole nother level as far as, like, magical energy goes, okay? Like, you're, for some of you, it could even be, like, psychics, mediumists, people who do this, tarot, okay? People who are empaths, all right? Take the time to research because he will help you to lay out the foundation so that you are able to transform into your own divine magical power, okay? To help you slay the day. Look, I mean, I am going to pull this out just because it was laying like this. I'm going to pull this out here. Halls of a minty initiation yes that's what i'm talking about so a lot of you are mathematicians a lot of you are getting into the um geography okay a lot of you are building like i said but learning learning where you come from learning about the um egyptians as well your ancestors learning your background okay we're getting secrets revealed treasures uncovered and initiation so we have initiation twice so akashic records yeah you're definitely leveling up yourself this is all about you this is about rewriting your story okay he is literally helping you to initiate rewriting your whole entire story releasing your past and to be able to break through and find freedom. Okay, a lot of you, I see stairs, so leveling up, ascension. Okay, a lot of you could be seeing 5-5, five, five, meaning change. Okay, but yeah, I definitely feel like if you haven't already, go to the root problem. Ground yourself. Go out into Mother Nature. A lot of you could be uh, going out like near trees or live by a lot of trees, okay? Um, wow. Okay. So, yeah, just by doing this, I feel like a lot of past karmic situations, as far as ancestors go, you are clearing it. And that's why they're saying you're slaying it. Like, you are literally cutting cords, doing the energy work, clearing old karmic past situations or relationships or whatever the case may be. But you're slaying it. Alright? You're piercing right through. Like, you don't give no Fs. <laughs> you're just like, I'm going all in. I am revealing everything okay we are uncovering all of the topics okay and this is why you're transforming look palladian activation okay so you you're definitely a star seed okay star seeds i am definitely speaking to you okay coming together harmony in the heavens and resolution so i definitely feel like in the near future there will be a resolution coming together. What else would you like to say for the near future? Or about the spirit? Because we definitely have in the spirit, you feel like everything is coming together. Because in the mind, you're believing that you can in the physical body. Yes, in the spirit, you are upgrading your crown chakra. So look. Your ground, okay, yeah, definitely. Someone who does a lot of Reiki healing. Because I do see, like, you are activating all levels of your chakras. We have crown, we have third eye, we have base chakra, heart chakra. So I definitely feel like you're flowing through, and this is why 
you are just like this person who they cannot take their eyes off of because you are just a like a miracle i'm hearing miracle baby miraculous energy holy experiences divine connection so yeah you are totally tapped into the divine like there's no denying of it look we got light shining from the bottom to the top okay a lot of you can be seeing white doves as a sign of you know your spirit guides are around and look not only do we have one dove here because this is you we have multiple wings here so remember you're not alone you have heavy star seeds angel beings okay you have galactic platinum energy in you okay even egyptian okay you could be tapping into all of these that i'm speaking of right now and you're clearing out old negative energy rewriting your story okay a lot of i'm speaking of people who have reincarnated multiple times and continues to slay it every single time that you come back. Okay, I'm hearing give a pat on the back. You know, for believing in yourself, for believing in that you could and that you can. And because of this, you are activating memories of where you come from. Okay, a lot of you are come from the the water realm, okay, Atlantis. A lot of you could be Lemurians. Lemuria, okay? You're remembering the life that you once had and you are reinitiating this life and being able to move forward with the technology that we have now. Because remember, you know, back in <laughs> whenever this was, because I can't even wrap my mind around it, you know, back when they were growing the civilization they didn't have the technology that we have now so you are tapping into this divine energy to be able to build or rebuild with this spiritual information or downloads that you are getting to create a new life here on earth wow i am present Look, this is you. This is your light being. This is like you like truly activating yourself. And it goes, I believe in the power of I can. Yeah, you are the light body. You are activating everything. This is you. Accessing the divine within. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is insane. This isn't, it's not insane, but it's like, okay, you have a spirit guide watching you slay it. Okay. Look at all this light. Okay. At the beginning of the, the reading, I even said light worker. Okay. You're definitely transforming into this light. So just be proud. Okay. Be proud of all that you are doing because they are very proud of you. I'm going to pull some some uh, angel messages or ancestor messages that they would like to come through. Yeah. They definitely see that you are doing the work. Like you are definitely doing the work and they are very grateful and honored to be working with you. I like I just I just get this overwhelming feeling of like they really do love you and they say you know it's time to shine okay a lot of you have been kind of confused you know maybe about where you come from or what you're supposed to do here but i feel like you know they're saying it's time to answer the call and not be afraid to to speak your truth okay to activate this magical energy within you What would you like to say to these star beings from the Galactic Council? Alright, we'll take it. You always have the best ideas. 
you always have the best idea. So I feel like you always have like downloads coming in from your spirit guides, okay? They really do believe that you have the best ideas. You may not always apply it. But, you know, when you are in doubt, know that they do believe in the power that you hold because really you are helping them to progress. You really are someone who is tech savvy and maybe even community like oriented, okay? Like you really just want to allow things to come together, join together again in harmony, okay? Like it was, like it used to be, okay? Like this energy is so off in this world that like it's definitely not how it used to be and I feel like these light workers out here are they have some of the best ideas almost always <laughs> you always you always have the best ideas so don't ever doubt yourself okay it says from now on I choose to stand up for myself when necessary and be assertive in a kind and calm manner because my Feelings matter. From now on, I choose to stand up for myself, okay? So a lot of you in the past have not always been able to do that, okay? I feel like because you are believing in your power, you're now able to stand up for yourself. You're able to be um, setting those healthy boundaries and be assertive when you need to, but also in a kind and calm manner. So sometimes, you know, being assertive doesn't always need to be angry um, or mean but you know you can express yourself kindly <laughs> and calmly which we all do have struggling with so you know take it how it resonates but your feelings they want to let you know that they do matter okay and they are being recognized like they like I said at the beginning they have their eyes on you you are protected <laughs> It says, I feel the love of those who are not around me. Okay, so this could be past loved ones. You know, somebody who recently passed away that you may be thinking about. But in your spirit, you know, you have these guides out here. You have almost <laughs> a whole backing of counsel guides behind you. So whenever you do feel like you are alone... They want to let you know that you do have the love around you, even when you feel like you don't, okay? We have, I believe in you. You can do anything you set your mind to. So yeah, I believe. They believe in you. You should believe in yourself because you have great ideas and they want you to answer the call. They want you to speak your truth. They want you to shine. They don't want you to put yourself in a box, Okay, just so you can dumb down yourself for other people just because they're jealous. No, let them look. Believe in the things that you're doing and set your mind to it and have a clear cut vision of what you want. Ask the divine or say, hey, divine, I need this. It's going to activate. I cannot give up until I have tried every conceivable way. So, yeah, this is you not giving up. And they're also saying don't give up on yourself. Because they are here helping you to transform. Okay? They're helping you to access these gifts that you have. They're able that, you know, that they know that you have the full potential. So they're saying don't give up. We, they're saying we know that it's hard. But you have to believe in the power of yourself. The power that is held behind you. Okay? And within you, okay? Find your bliss. Hmm. I am following a path I love and I am fully aligned to my soul purpose. So a lot of you need to be saying this positive affirmation three times. I am following a path I love and I am fully aligned to my soul purpose. I am following a path I love and I am fully aligned to my soul purpose purpose okay when you say positive affirmations three times it will start to um 
you know, activate within your soul. It will initiate this transformation. And they are saying that it will help you define your bliss, okay? When you believe wholeheartedly in the ideas that you have, you are able to allow things to manifest into your life, okay? Know that you are aligned on the right path and that you're being loved, okay? And they want you to align to your soul purpose, whatever that may be. You are an amazing friend. So yeah, I was just getting like this community, like vibes, all right? Like a lot of people are around you that really look up to you. They believe in your power. They believe in you. They believe in your ideas. So take the time to do that for yourself. I'm also getting the number six. So number six is a power number. Okay, you could even be seeing black cats. Um, this number six is... Um, magic, divine magic in you. This could be in the number of six days, okay? But really tapping into that divine energy, that divine magic, so that you are able to transform. And then we got the number three. So some of you could be 63, 36, okay? But power number three, you could be a life path number six. Um, like I said, throughout this whole reading, you could be seeing double threes, knowing that you are a master teacher. Okay, I am more than good enough and I get better every day. So give yourself more credit, even when it feels like there's no movement. Okay. Um, last but not least, in every situation, we must find the small blessings and you will see a bliss of miracles come into your life. So always see the positive in everything. Even if you get irritated, um, find the small blessings, okay? Even, you know, give offerings to your ancestors, okay? Some of you could even be doing that, but seeing the bliss in everything and then you will start to see things transform for you and not against you. So keep on slaying it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below, and take care.